How's it going everybody and welcome back to another video. So today we're gonna try and make a bit more of a dent in this achievement list. Last episode we got quite a lot of the easy ones out the way with, so I think these are gonna start getting a bit more grindy. So let's see how much progress we make this time. That being said, let's get into the video. Alright guys, let's get these caskets open. It's usually pretty standard loot, but let's just see if we get anything. Crystal keys, always catches me up. Another master clue, but cool. Yeah, it's all pretty standard trash loot at this point. Another master, it's good. Oh, crystal keys. Man, they always catch me out so much, it's <laughs> so annoying. Another master, back to back. Yeah, no more. Trash. Master. Cool. More crystal keys. Trash pages. Actually, it was worth quite a bit. 3.5 mil. Another master. Very nice. More keys. Wrong keys. Master. Another master. Another master and keys. Jeez. Oh, damn, another dragon mag. Cool. Nice. Another master? Another master. Jeez, all these masters. And another master. Jesus Christ. Man, my bank is so full. <laughs> Jesus Christ, how many masters am I getting here? Oh, crystal keys. Some now. That's the Amadil page. Okay. Another master. Very cool. Okay, calm down with the masters at this point. Jesus. It's pretty trash. Master. Cool. Trash. Another master. Another master. Jesus Christ. This is insane how many masters I'm getting from these. Just pretty standard loot besides the amount of masters I'm getting at this point. Yep, just a ton of stuff. Another master. And for the final one, another master. <laughs> that is crazy. So, out of those 40, we ended up getting 26 master clues. That's insane. And a fourth dragon mag, I think that is now, which probably puts me at uh, drop rate at this point. Let's have a look. Tetra. Uh, yeah, that puts me at drop rate. Okay guys, so we're going to start off with Everything is Awesome achievement. Uh, as you can see, I've got quite a lot to mine. It shouldn't take too long, so I'll be back when we're about done. I didn't realise I was so close to a level, but there's 105 mining. So I'm just here at the Bay Knight R, it's the last one I need to get, so yeah, I'll be back when it's done. And with that, that is Everything is Awesome complete. On to the next one. So next up we've got the I'm Forever Washing Shadows achievement. I just need to kill a load of these shadows at Prif, and then just deposit them in the center. So we've got 15 truthful shadow cores to cleanse. And 15 sh blissful shadow cores to cleanse. And 15 manifest shadow cores to cleanse. So if we speak to Lord Amlod, this should be... I'm forever washing shadows. Complete. Okay, so next up we've got Potion Mixmaster 1. Um, as you can see, I don't have all of the recipes unlocked, but I thought I might as well just unlock the ones that I can at the moment, um, and then we'll sort of get the pages for the other potions as we do Dungeoneering. So it's not the achievement I needed, but I ended up getting Potion Mixmaster 2, so that's always a winner, I guess. <laughs> So from our Down With Love, I need to fully upgrade this penguin spy device. I need 40 penguin points, but I've only got 11, so it's going to take a little while. 
Alright, so I'm actually missing 15 kudos for the kudos to you achievement. Uh, I'm gonna have to have a look around to find where that is. So I got a random achievement by talking to this guy and going through all the options. So that's just an extra achievement. So I ended up getting another 10 kudos just by talking to this guy. Um, he's going on about a book uh, that I, I guess I need to go find, but we'll see. So I just need five more kudos. So I went and got every book that I could out of the uh, Varric library and brought it here with me. So I'm hoping one of these books is right. And there we are. Kudos to you, complete. So next up I think we'll go find all the engrams for Memories of Guthix. It shouldn't take too long. So for anyone wondering where the engrams are, here's the fairy one. Here's the gnome one. Here's the druid one. Here's the jazz one. Here's the sheep one. Here's the time one. Here's the guardians one. Here's the balance one. And here is the sword one. So now that we've collected all the engrams, each one needs a different amount of different types of energy to charge up. And then once that's done, we can just go hand them in. So yeah, let's get that done. So once we hand all these engrams in, that should be Memories of Guthix complete. So for data recovery, I just have two bots that I need to do, so this shouldn't take too long. That's the last bot that I need to do, so I want to hand this in. That should be data recovery complete. I've been doing some AFK fishing and I got pretty lucky with the last two golden fish eggs that I need, so I'll go chuck these into my house and that should be another achievement done. So I just need to come spend the prawn points and that should be almost as perky as a prawn complete. So our quest for the episode is going to be back to the freezer. Um, in the long run it's going to help us with the from our down with love achievement so let's get this one done. Man they always make these puzzles really tedious. I think I've been trying to find this thing for like at least 10 times now but there we are. They've got all the little penguin disguises here. They've even got the holiday ones. That's cool. Back to the Future is like my favourite film, so seeing this is just amazing. You've got to give it to the writers of RuneScape. The amount of puns and plays on word in the quests are just... It's hilarious. I don't, I don't know where they come up with it. Does anyone even know where this is? Because I cannot remember the last time I had to come here. I am so confused with this puzzle right now, I don't even know where to begin. Okay, I was super close here, but I think I'm getting it? I don't know. Okay, well I just got super lucky here, but that's the puzzle done. Alright, so once I'm done talking with Chuck, that should be the quest complete. Um, it'll let me get more of the penguin points to work towards the other achievement that I mentioned further down the line, so yeah, that's back to the freezer complete. So I'm going to use these lamps on dungeoneering because one, I hate dungeoneering, and two, uh, that's 113 dungeoneering, which is halfway to 120. Alright guys, I think that's a good place to end this episode. My luck recently has been pretty insane with getting another dragon mark and in my clue series I actually ended up getting a, an ice die so yeah it's just been absolutely crazy at the moment and I feel we've made quite a good dent in the achievement list this time round so can't complain at that. As I said last time I think the achievements are gonna start getting a little bit more grindy as well so I'm gonna have to sit down and have a look at them again and see which one we can work towards. That being said thank you very much for watching like it if you like it, dislike it if you dislike it, and I'll catch you in the next one.